This dream is from Wolfie. Okay. This was about a huge UFO, weird sounds, fire dropping from the skies from a meteorite. Interesting night. Here we go. I'm going to tell the story as if I am Wolfie. All right. I don't know why, but I was at my grandmother's house with my sister, my dad, my grandmother, and my grandfather, and my sister's husband and one-year-old son. There was a couple of other people there that I didn't know. It was a clear night. I'd say it was around nine, and we were all eating hot dogs on the porch. Then I looked up and yelled to everyone saying, look! A meteor! It exploded in the sky. <laughs> and little bits with fire, just little bits, you know, little chunks with fire on them, fell everywhere. It was quite beautiful to see. We all ran off the porch, and then we hear these loud, weird sounds. Okay, listen. We walked down the driveway to where the tree was, and we looked above the church across the street. And Patricia, I'm going to tell you right now, I was terrified. My heart just dropped. There was this huge UFO hovering by the church, and my family wasn't there with me looking at it. They were on the driveway. And you couldn't see it from there because the barn was covering it. I turned around and it, it felt like I couldn't, I lost my voice. I couldn't speak there for a minute. So I just ran up to my sister. I told her there was a UFO. And I said to her, I knew this would happen. I'm going to tell you, Pat, even though I've had some longer, crazier dreams, this one has probably been my scariest. I believe we need to be ready for September. Okay? God bless you. That's the end of his dream. It's a little scary now, isn't it? So, I don't know what's coming. I don't know what's going on. But I know that even on some of the YouTube videos, this is Patricia talking now, my little commentary. You know, it's, I always have to put my two cents in there. I saw on the on YouTube a number of videos from people's cell phones and just different things where there were weird looking creatures. I remember during the um, uh, one of the uh, floods, the the latest tsunamis over the last two years or so. This one guy was just videotaping. And before you know it, you see these little white things. They were shaped almost like whales with little narrow tails. But they swam up. They looked ghostly. When they swam up out of the water, they developed legs and were climbing. I said, oh, this is crazy. So we have no idea what kind of creatures are lurking outside of our view. So don't be surprised when things start materializing that we never knew existed.